Okay, Eddie. Come on, we need to find survivors. More than two people could have hidden somewhere in this place. Hopefully there won't be powder gangers as well. Military surplus magazines. Old money. Uh, damn it. There's a safe. Jesus, even the bath's filled with water. And the raiders appear to have taken everything of worth from here. Most of the town appears to be burned. What? Ah, just some wildlife. Whoa! Bad scorpion. Well, somebody looked like they stood up and fought. It's got a laser rifle, but the damn thing's so bust up, I can barely use it. Huh. Remains of a legionary. Oof. An unpleasant mess. Hello, anybody? More damn lottery tickets. Come on. Blood and runes. That's all that's left. Let's check out a few more buildings. Yeah, oh, that's a bad sign. Don't think anybody in here is going to be found. again. And in here. Whoa, what the? Is that a bark scorpion? Who the hell fills a house with scorpions and landmines? And tripwires. Huh. Well, here's one way of dealing with a tripwire. Another tripwire. Simple as. Oh, well, the traps look like they got one legionary. Yeah, nothing of worth in here. Cram. More cabinets. Shit, I'm gonna have to start looking for more bobby pins at this rate. Atomic cocktails and wine. More supplies. And a shotgun. 
Another shotgun trap. Oh, I don't know what this sets off. Stand up and... Oh, crap. Sorry, Eddie. Careful. Got it. Who the hell keeps it safe in the bathroom? Ooh. This is coming in useful if we find any more legionaries. Magnum rounds. Whoever this guy was, he was prepared. Don't know if he survived, though. No, no signs of life in here except for scorpions. Well, and they're now dead. Ah, Jesus. Oh, hell. Even for powder gangers, that's just wrong. So remove them from the cross would kill them. Guess this is mercy. Oh crap. Gun at the ready. That's a lot of them. Don't worry. I won't have you lashed to a cross like the rest of these degenerates. It's useful that you happen by. I want you to witness the fate of the town of Nipton. To memorize every detail. And then, when you move on, I want you to teach everyone you meet the lesson that Kaisar's Legion taught here. Especially any NCR troops you run across. And what lessons exactly are those? Where to begin? That they are weak, and we are strong? This much was known already. But the depth of their moral sickness, their dissolution? Nipton serves as the perfect object lesson. What exactly did you do? Nipton was a wicked place, debased and corrupt. It served all comers, so long as they paid. Profligate troops, powder gangers, men of the Legion, such as myself. The people here didn't care. It was a town of whores. For a pittance, the town agreed to lead those it had sheltered into a trap. Only when I sprang it did they realize they were caught inside it too. You captured everyone? Yes and herded them to the center of town. I told them their sins, the foremost being disloyalty. I told them that when legionaries are disloyal, some are punished, the others made to watch. And I announced the lottery. Each clutched his ticket, hoping it would set him free. Each did nothing, even when loved ones were dragged away to be killed. You slaughtered innocent civilians? Ha! <laughs> Innocent. Hardly. Cowardly, though. They outnumbered us. Yet not once did they try to resist. They stood and watched as their fellows were butchered, crucified, and burned. One by one. They stood and hoped their turn would not come. Each cared only for himself. Ugh. Fuck you. As are all crimes. If you feel strongly about it, attack us, and soon you won't feel a thing. Jesus. What do you reckon we do, Eddie? Hang on. Hey, fox boy. 
Got a present for you. Pop a super stem pack. Holy shit. Well, I do. What do you know? Couple of grenades. And we got them. Part of a downside, I don't think Caesar's Legion is going to be too pleased with us. See what they had. Cowboy repeater, anti venom, denarius. Machetes, throwing spears. Christ, these guys are low tech. Denarius. They look like they're worth a lot of money. More magnum rounds. Where's Fox Boy? Ah, here he is. Oof. Looks like my grenade got you good. And an ass ton of money. Anti venom. And you know what? I'm gonna have your fox. Oh, and another thing. That'll be all. Oh dear. Let's check it, see if anybody at all escaped. What the hell was that? This place must be trapped. Corpses. More corpses. Jesus. This was a massacre. Oh Christ! Well, at least that key will make getting in and out of things quicker. Hello? Ah, uh, poor bastard must have tried to hide. Anyone in the basement? I hear barking. Ah, uh, Sunset Sass Brothers. Grenades. Uh, we'll take that healing powder and use it. Good job we had those super stim packs. Otherwise, I think that would have been the end for me. Alright. Let's drink some sarsaparillas. Aha! Uh -huh. Got me a shiny cap. And a new Coca Cola. Could do with the caffeine. Christ. Eddie? Eddie? Ah. Sometimes I wonder why I worry about you. You're a good little robot, you know that? Turbo. Mother load. Uh, bust up old plasma rifle. Not worth the effort it'll take to fix it up. Nobody. So I've left the place teeming with traps. Oh shit, and fucking 
dogs. And a giant cockroach. That was a lovely touch. Old schoolhouse. Okay, let's check the right. Another one of those damn dogs. This must have been the council. Okay. I think we can unequivocally, uh, unequivocally say that the first floor is completely clear and there's no survivors. About oh crap. These mongrels are beginning to annoy me. Hmm. At least this person had some weapons. Guess they have less use for them now. Second floor is clear. All that le left is uh, up here. Vending machine. Two sarsaparillas and two Nuka Colas. So if I drink the Nuka Colas, I won't have to sleep for a while. No lucky stars there. Could do with more water there. We'll have that. Ah, uh, completely empty. And in here. empty as well. Ooh, two stim packs. That's a lucky find. Nope, nothing.
Ah, more bobby pins, just what we needed. Laser pistols, even more bobby pins. <laughs> Testing. I can hardly believe my luck. Literally, I am a gate. Just now, I was approached by a rather intense young man calling himself Mr. Fox. Yeah, right. And go on. No, wait. I haven't read this one. Yeah, right. When we were alone in my office, he let, let it be known that he was a member of Caesar's Legion. He knew that the NCR troops and powder gangers often spent time in Nipton. It turns out that the Legion hates and wishes to make an example of both groups. The NCR for obvious reasons and powder gangers for harassing the Legion raiding parties on this side of the river. Yeah, we've read this bit in the book that we found. I didn't think f have to think a moment before accepting Fox's position. After I have to do, all I have to do is convince the powders to kidnap the NCR troops at night. When both groups are in town, the Legion boys will scoop up everyone up. For this simple task, I have been offered 8,000 caps. I could almost go back to the NCR right away, but who knows how much else I might be able to make off this Legion lackey. I'm going to start stockpiling some supplies in a safe house between here and the Mojave outpost just in case I decide to head back home in a hurry. Very excited. Signed with a steady hand on the keyboard. Super Mayor Joseph B. Stain, 3rd, Esquire. So he sold out the goddamn town, and in return, the, pa the uh, Legion threw him on top of a pyre and burned him alive. Hi, Roller. A promising development, if I do say so myself. Seems things went to hell at the NCR Correctional Facility north of here, and escaped prisoners are roaming free. Sounds like a bad thing, and would be if not for the political acumen and the interpersonal alchemy of yours truly, Mayor Joseph B. Stein, Esquire. I sent the gyms out to make contact with prisoners prisoners, or powder gangers, rather, they insist on this name, to let them know Nipton's open for trade, with free turns with the girls as door prizes. Ha, huh. you know they went for that deal, a sold by little Jim. Anyway, Big Jim, R.I.P. I see a lot of potential here, so long as I can keep the NCR troops and powder gangers, really ridiculous name, from running into each other and shooting it out in the streets. Luckily, the troopers only come at night, double entendre. So if the powders will only come during the day, again, I'll have them coming, third time the charm, and going. Yours in confidence. Prison break. Tony was kind enough to build this terminal and set it up for me, all 30 caps worth of Rosie. Huh. The life of a mayor suits me just fine. I'm glad I didn't go for any further east. I'm making plenty of caps right here off Rosie and Sylvia. We attract plenty of interest from troops at the Mount Harvey outpost. Guess you spend enough time standing around that backwater and you'd be ready to hop on anything that l looks like a mole rat and doesn't smell much better. And the local shops are all giving me a percentage of the sales to the troops because it's my girls who bring them in. Ha, huh, they think for a shrewd negotiator for getting me to accept a 15% cut instead of 20. Another year in this dump, two at the most, then it's back to the hub for me. Maybe I'll run, in my off run for office there. Okay, so essentially the mayor did business with both the Powder Gangers, and the NCR, and Caesar's Legion, and he paid dearly for it. So in return I'm going to borrow his book, and never return it. Well... After he proceeds to get his entire town killed, I guess the least we can do is steal everything he owns. Well, owned, now that he's crispy crispy. Buff out, 10mm rounds, a pistol. Ooh, a fancy Nuka Cola. Armor case, 357, bobby pins. Gun cabinet, 10 millimeter, two bust up old energy rifles, pre war money, uh huh. Well, we figured out what happened to a town. 
Unfortunately, any survivors that there were have already been captured and enslaved. Probably need to go free them at some point. Oh, but I think we're out east. And I find it highly doubtful that anybody's left around here. Ugh. On the right side. Nipton has been avenged. Oof. I can report back to Ghost happily and let her know that. Looks like this couple died together. Oh well. Time to grit our teeth and head back to Mojave Outpost. Go on, Eddie. Let's make tracks.